Philippines has three metropolitan regions as officially recognized by the National Economic Development Authority. These metropolitan regions were defined in response to the need to sustain the growing urban population and to provide an integrated approach to interlinking urban concerns. These regions are also major economic hubs in the country where leading commercial, industrial and financial centers. First of the three is the Metro Manila. This is the seat of government in the country. It is composed of 16 highly urbanized cities. The city of Manila, Quezon City, Caloocan, Las Pinas, Makati, Malibun, Mandalayong, Marikina, Montinlopa, Navotas, Paranaque, Pasay, Pasig, San Juan, Taguig, and Valenzuela, as well as the municipality of Pateros. The region encompasses an area of 619.57 square kilometers and a population of 13.6 million people as of 2020. It is the most populous and the most densely populated region in the Philippines. It is also the ninth most populous metropolitan area in Asia and the fifth most populous urban area in the world. The region is the center of culture, including arts and entertainment, economy, education and government of the Philippines. Designated as a global power city, the region exerts a significant impact on commerce, finance, media, art, fashion, research, technology, education, and entertainment both locally and internationally. It is the home to all embassies in the Philippines, thereby making it an important center for international diplomacy in the country. Its economic power makes the region the country's premier center for finance and commerce. The region accounts for 36% of the gross domestic product of the Philippines. The second metropolitan in the Philippines is the Metro Cebu. It is the main urban center of the province of Cebu. Located along the center or eastern portion of the Cebu including the nearby island of Mactan. Metro Cebu encompasses an area of 1,062.88 square kilometers and a population of 3.3 million people as of 2020. It accounts for 19.9% of the land area and 61.5% of the population of the entire province of Cebu. Metro Cebu comprises seven cities, Kaka, Cebu City, Danao, Lapulapu, Manui, Naga, Talisay, and six municipalities, Compostela, Consolation, Cordova, Liloan, Minglanilla, San Fernando, with Cebu City serving as the metropolitan area's central core. The provincial capital, the central business district, major educational institutions and the international port are all located in Cebu City while major industrial companies and factories are located in Manmui. The International Airport and the Export Processing Zone are located in Lapu-Lapu in Magdan Island. Danao is primarily a mining city while Talisay is a residential city with its income generated by small and medium-sized businesses. Metro Cebu, as the second most important metropolitan area of the Philippines has established itself as a major economic hub, attracting several multinational companies in various industries ranging from business process outsourcing, electronics, pharmaceuticals, tourism, and among other industries. Metro Cebu, and Cebu province as a whole has experienced rapid economic growth since the early 1990s. The third metropolitan is Metro Davao. This is a metropolitan area in the Mindanao Island group. It includes the cities of Davao City, Digos, Mati, Panabo, Samal, Tagum, and spanned parts of all five provinces of Davao region. It is the largest metropolitan region by land area and the second most populous in the Philippines. It is administered by Metropolitan Davao Development Authority. The metropolitan area has 6,492.8 square kilometers, making it the largest metropolitan area in the Philippines in terms of land area. 
It also has a population of 3.5 million in the combined population sizes of the local government units, making it the second most populous metropolitan area in the country after Metro Manila and the most populous in the entire Visayas and Mindanao region. Metro Davao is one of the largest in the country and the most economically active in Mindanao. Davao City, from which the metropolitan area is centered, is known as the crown jewel of Mindanao due to its status as the premier city, the financial and trade center and hub of Mindanao. There are several industrial and business establishments within the metropolitan area as well. Industrial plants in Davao City, Santa Cruz and Digos generate income for their respective LGUs as well as for the locals living there. Banana plantations in the northern part of the metropolitan area also contribute to the metropolitan, as well as the national economy. Local fruits such as dorians, mangoes, pineapples, and mangosteens are also exported abroad. Thank you for watching. See you in my next video.